I'm laughing because yet again I I probably did almost start talking before that massive red not recording sign was off the screen. But anyway, we're going to talk about an interesting new service and a data breach that occurred with them on today's not so poopy update. Breaking news. Shit's hit the fan. <laughs> um, a feces delivery service called Shit Express had 24,000 emails breached. Uh, data, I guess, included IP, physical addresses, names, and messages accompanying the posted shit. Um, 76% were already in Have I Been Pawned. So... This touches on a, a topic or um, discussion that we had earlier in the week about third parties, their data collection, and their security practices or lack thereof, and how they can affect services is, is like that what, Shit is Express. That, is that the tone we're taking with this story, John? We're going serious. Is it? We're, we're talking, well, this touches I think on some I think uh, that we've... This is some pretty serious shit, Peter. <laughs> yeah. Two. Yeah. These guys um, are in deep doo doo. They yeah, are. Three. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. Oh, so when I'm the one making puns, no, nobody's on board. Yeah, that's because this is too hard. Out. Yeah. Well, you know, you, you really should. It's not good for you to force it, though. <laughs> I'm not forcing. I'm not forcing anything. How long do you think they were sitting Unless on, I'm on the toilet before it, it, four, it, it, five? <laughs> I think. Okay. Um, how long were they sitting on this for? Six. So <laughs> this is going to be really hard to get through. Mm -hmm. We will do our best. Gonna, we can squeeze it out, don't worry. It's yeah, fine. fucking seven. Yeah. Nice. <laughs> Very good. Very good. Um. Uh, yeah. So I think <laughs> it's still still to with a have, serious tone here. I'm gonna have a I'm gonna have a think on this. While I yeah. I, uh, um, I, would, yeah. I I was the 76 percent uh, overlap did stand out to me that of, of all the emails that were oh, compromised, 76 really? percent of them had already previously been compromised. And it makes me Very wonder common. what other business they have overlap with to that extent. Uh, yeah. My, no, it's very standard. It's just anybody. Uh, with, are you familiar with Have I Been but Pwned? It, but that's a very high number, Peter. I feel like that could be a so. previous hack. That could be a the people who use the service are just signing up for shit. Not a pun intended. Literally, that is exactly what they're signing up for. Um, you know, so the, the thing that the, the, um, the real solid part of the um of the of the breach uh to me was the fact that the messages so this is a let's just describe what the service is right it's a shit delivery service feces as a service where you can get uh i don't know if it's human uh shit delivered to your and this is the thing i got friends and enemies for, like for, for, also your friends you can have this delivered to and you can send a little note along with it. And it, yeah, you can send someone, send someone shit in the post, um, <clears throat> which is bonkers. And um, I don't know, just hilarious. Um, but yeah, you, the notes that came up with it, that was part of the data breach. I really want to get hold of this data set and see what kind of messages people are sending to each other. I think yeah. Just um, beautiful. It is crazy that this even is allowed to um you know keep going like that it's still uh running loose yeah so so i'm just having a quick look at the have i been pwned uh twitter account where they do the announcements of there's been a breach this many people were um uh affected and this many were already in the database have i been pwned is so big and they have so many different kinds of data breaches that the 70 percent is not high at all so for example with uh, the latest uh, tweet there is uh site point had one million customer records exposed 70 percent were already in have hmm. i been pwned okay uh, fair 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 <laughs> okay that's yeah, yeah. that's a, okay so maybe there isn't actually any correlation at all um yeah it is so. still it is still important you know especially when we're talking about hate mail which is very like it's kind of a dodgy business to begin with. So, yeah, like, the, I think the first big one we saw was glitter bombing, and when you have a service yeah. like this, you really have to make sure you're protecting your senders because they're kind of committing a crime. 
Um, <laughs> so the crime is the service. Is it uh, actually it is, illegal? It, to but, it, but it, I think it is. It is. I, I imagine it is. If I received one of these, I now maybe have access to go and figure out who sent it to me. That's true. DNA tracking through feces is a thing, and <laughs> not, but really, not the horse what that I, I imagine. From, just- what I imagine is that, um, oh, that's true. You're right because of the breach. I didn't think about that. Um, speaking of breaches, I don't the- think it's the people you sign up and you send shit express a sample your 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 own feces. No, no, right? No, they, no, take they take care just- of everything. They take no, care no, of everything. No, no. Yeah. yeah, like you can do, do you DIY, like- I guess, if you wanted to. But do, so I wonder if the creators. Like a- do you think the founders went to like farms and were like, "Hey, we want your shit"? Like, well. Yeah. So the source of this story actually is a shit article from Bleeping Computer. What? I saw on the Twitters. Yeah, but wow, the tweet okay. was uh, about this article from Bleeping Computer. That's about shit. It's a perfectly oh. good article. I'm just saying it's literally about shit. Um, and they outline how the service works. Well, as, and the first as, step as, is... We should, we should clarify, as all articles are perfectly good mm-hmm. from Bleeping Computer. Uh, that's up for debate. Yeah, <clears throat> well... I just want to make it cl- clear. I it's your opinion, Peter. Love the bleeping bleep. computer. <clears throat> and that's your guys' opinions. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Sorry. Go ahead, Mike. Uh, ju- so they outline that the first step is choosing the animal that you're electing to send from. And they talked about, uh, they like, they went to a farm and get horse, for example. But I don't know what all of your options are. We probably could find it's out. Human- probably could have found out before this. Let's... uh. And yeah, fuck it, do it live. Do it live. <clears throat> yeah, I would love to get this data set. Imagine yeah. the messages. It must be on the dark web somewhere. Where can we get it from? John, you give me your credit card leaked? number. <laughs> Is that no? Uh, that would be messy. Um, yeah, it must have been. It's a, it's a data breach. So. Hmm. Hmm. Uh, gluten-free okay. kosher horse shit. <laughs> We're genuinely being, being quiet here, just watching you yeah. scroll through a site. No, we'll just, uh, yeah. Okay. This is going to make people subscribe, Mike. Peter. By the this way, this is address, the kind Peter? of content we normally quality. have. It's quality shit. <laughs> quality Go ahead, Peter. I'm ready for your you address. the animal? Yeah, yeah. Okay. So it's, it looks like uh, our oh, horse or elephant do, look like our options. And you can pay with Bitcoin. Interesting. Mm-hmm. Yeah, if you want to be really anonymous. So, okay, great. Glad we had that little interlude there. Good. Glad, I'm sorry for for anybody who's still watching. You must love us, so please, you know, if you're not subscribed already, we'll do it live. click that Fuck button. It. Um, do it live. And for more smelly, I don't know. Come on, quality Give content. Me. Quality content. Yes. Yes.